Sorry, I don't speak Fante yet. <laughs> but do know that. I can't speak again. And then we all gather to. Next day, we all gather to. We are sent to them. Amen. Okay, now. We feel like we was in truth. We were in truth. Oh, no. We are from Chetty. Hello, Tim. Hello, Masi. To see your your talent that many people have not seen, so I look forward to seeing it, and I I am so happy to be here. Oh wow, Chief Linda, <laughs> this is nice. hello there kings and queens welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi there darling welcome but if you're a returning subscriber thank you for always coming back to watch my videos so guys we are heading to the central region exactly in search of linda in search of a linda an african-american who moved to ghana some years back and have been loving life here so you know these are the stories that i like to bring to you guys seeing ghana through the eyes of others so let's go or let's say seeing africa through the eyes of others for those of us that have never uh, make our way out of africa we are surprised when we see people come back and want to be acquainted and get used to the culture and enjoy living here and vow never to move out of here again so let's go to the central come with me to cape coast not exactly cape coast but you get to see more as we make our way to this region of ghana so i have traveled this road countlessly uh, countlessly but i think i have always had issues filming the road trip but not today because i came prepared as you can see i am ready to roll so um i'm getting to this town that i'm heading to let me give the video away a little maybe for better understanding so linda and a friend of hers who is also african-american who also moved to ghana some years back uh here they actually adopted linda adopted this town as a hometown so she does everything that indigenous of that town do she's acquainted to the gods of the land she's acquainted to the culture of the people learning the language you know little by little influencing more people to move those who want to move anyways and today she's a special guest of honor at an event that is happening in her hometown and i am invited for that so come with me let's go and see Yeah. 
about three hours 30 minutes drive we finally made our way to this town and this place is called Abakrakba. so i'm gonna like try to leave the name on the screen because i'm certain i didn't get that pronunciation correctly but you correct you see the spelling and then decide how to pronounce it so we're finally here and then they're taking linda and her friend who came all the way from emena to support her they're taking them around showing them and introducing her to everyone that matters because she is like that daughter of the land that does not live in the in the village or town she lives in the city only comes home during occasion even though she lives here as well because she have a house here and she have other things that she does here but she comes home occasionally i don't know if you get it just like that daughter who lives in the city that is how she is so she comes home and um, occasions are happening she get introduced to everyone that matters she get acquainted to everybody now they are, we are being introduced to the gods gods of the land i mean there are deities here you must respect other people's culture okay so just in case you don't know and the name of this goddess i mean this god is called oh, i'm going to write it on the screen trust me i am not ready to bite my tongue so like i told you there's an occasion happening apart from the one that linda is here for where she's a special guest there's another occasion i think i should allow you people here this but i got really emotional now I got emotional and I'll tell you why and when. Well, when we got here, I was very, very surprised. Okay, I was shocked. As a Nigerian, I am not used to seeing barriers like these. When we got here, I thought it was a wedding. Respectfully, I was like, where is the bride? so the community leader told me oh it's not a wedding it's actually a funeral so i didn't know that this is how the fancy people this part of fancy celebrates really. their barrier their funeral so many gifts and i was very very surprised as a nigerian i see this all the time but it's definitely a wedding or a naming ceremony but yeah this is new founding yeah it's something new for me so if you is this the culture here in ghana or the Akan people or the fancy only i mean comment down below teach somebody sense today i don't know this so i am willing to learn okay so let me leave you to the original audio <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you. Family, family. Yes, family. Uh -huh. 
починає. Assuming there are a gathering of a festival or the Omani invited to see all these chiefs when they come, that's where they are received. That is the arrival hall, they sit down, they have a chat, if they bring water into whatever they do. All in of the Omani. You just go, that is where you are there, when you go there, you won't eat there. You will not take anything, it's just like visiting the state house. You are not going to eat before you meet the chief. We'll always remain that part where Linda and her friend hugged the old man. Do you remember when you go to your village or your hometown? There's this old uncle of yours you've not seen or they have not seen you for quite a while. And then when he sees you, he just hugs you and you are relaxed and happy. That is what is giving. It is giving that energy. So now they are doing a tour of their village, their town. I don't know how to classify this place. But when I say village, I don't mean to disrespect the place or the people. I'm... Maybe my own understanding of village is different from what is actually what a village actually means to others or actually is. So I'm um, sorry if I use that word. Okay, it's not to downgrade the place. It's actually a place with a lot of um, lot of people. It's quite populated and they have everything we have in the city. Almost everything we have in the cities. So yeah, not to disrespect. Now it's time to go to the market. They just want to be everywhere for good. Since they are here today, they just want to be acquainted to the environment, buy from the local women. Okay, I like that. So from here, we are going to see the gods of the land, the, the goddess of the land. So let me leave you guys to this, okay? What's this place called? Checheku. 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 Yeah. So what we saw over there that he was talking to you about yeah. is related to this. Okay. Yes. Yeah. So that goddess is from hey. the sea. It's so scenery. It's like yeah. right. It's, it's beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> hey. You know what I'm laughing at? My we in Africa once is did you related? No matter how you cute it looks. It. So the goddess yeah. I showed you. Yeah. That is why let's go up. Okay. Smooth. Mm -hmm. I just want to see, show you where it's been. For weird. Oh, I got it. That's just a I tree. almost got it. Good canopy. Yeah. I think I'll be doing like oh, this until I buy that. Yeah. Uh, is this connected to a river or lake? No, it's just, it's just there. It's just here. So where did the, the, the lake get for, its water from? Naturally, it came by itself. So. Does it dry up? Some, no, 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 no. it's never dry up. So. Even in January, December? No, no, it hasn't no, no, dried no. up before. Initially, it was bigger. Mm -hmm. So oh. as we delivered without clearing, that is where. But for now, for the past, 10, 15 years, this is how it has been. Never dry. And something. it flows. It flows. There's a bridge. Oh, it does flow. But it's, it's still like it is. Okay. Normally, we are told to believe this goddess. It's her brand. is in The goddess of the Okay. So the two are matched together like husband and wife. So we call her Papu Mtetuku And that one is in It's a female goddess. Enjoy. The water, the, the water looks like it's uh, clear. Yeah, it's not flowing. The water is very, very clear. Can 
So guys, it's time to return to the venue of the occasion where the occasion will be happening at their community center. Um, so pronouncing the name of this town always is a struggle for me, but I want to try, okay? I want to try Abba Krapa. Okay, so yeah. So we're going back to the community center to continue with the occasion that brought us here. I mean, that brought Linda here and her friend. So let's go and have some fun over there as everybody is, you know, coming into the venue one by one to fill up the place ahead of the occasion. And I spotted this adorable, extremely beautiful baby that I want to take home with me. Der Himmel ist grau Wer will schon allein sein? Dieses Gefühl kenn ich ganz genau Bin zu oft gescheitert Hab so viel riskiert Doch der Moment ist da Es wird endlich wahr Ich kann nicht glauben, dass es passiert Ich hab mein Leben lang gewartet Hab schon nicht mehr daran gebraucht Hab den Moment zu sehr herbeigesehnt In dem du meinen Atem brauchst Einfach Hals über Kopf Hals über Kopf Mit dir Einfach Hals über Kopf Hals über Kopf Es macht endlich Sinn Lass uns nie mehr vorbei sein Wir beide können nur gewinnen Ohne dich war mein Leben Nur eins ohne Plan Doch du bist endlich da Und der Traum wird wahr Ich kann nicht glauben Ich hab mein Leben lang gewartet Hab schon nicht mehr daran gekauft Hab den Moment zu sehr herbeigesehnt In dem du meinen Atem brauchst Einfach Hals über Kopf Hals über Kopf Mit dir Einfach Hals über Kopf Hals über Kopf I do wish I could leave the actual audio, but it's not possible because I believe by just watching the video, the, the dance steps of this beautiful uh, boys and girls will tell you the song that is playing in the background. And that means, mean, that means me going against the community guidelines. So I'm sorry I have to mute it. So today they're having their talent show where they nurture young, talented kids both if uh, dancing, music, poem, and even acting, they nurture that and then nurture them and send them out of here for competition. And a lot of the people seated here are musicians. These people have amazing songs. And I have, you know, been privileged to listen to some of them that I got sent, you know, that got sent to me. So this is... um their nature here they support and nurture any young talent they send you out there when there's competition you go compete and then you know that's how they do it and i'm very 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 happy for the fact that parents now pay attention to the gifts of their kids it's not everybody that should be an engineer or doctor or a lawyer some people are to go into the entertainment industry and it is okay so it's absolutely fine if your kid has the talent to dance. I, I mean, the way these kids dance, I I loved it. I loved it. So but I'm going to let you guys get to that part. Die 
Nächte sind einsam, der Himmel ist grau. Wer will schon allein sein? Dieses Gefühl kenne ich ganz genau. Bin zu oft gescheitert, hab so viel riskiert. Doch der Moment ist da, es wird endlich wahr. Ich kann nicht glauben, dass es passiert. Ich hab mein Leben lang gewartet, hab schon nicht mehr daran geglaubt. Hab den Moment zu sehr herbeigesehnt, in dem du meinen Atem raus einfach Hals über Kopf. In Germany, it's also a disability rights advocate.